Okay, we're here at 811 Kodak Street here in LA 90026. This is a 14 unit building and uh, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe throughout these units, uh, but I can tell you uh, that this inspection is based on my opinion. We started off by running the camera from a four inch clean out located underneath the building here on the south side and what I can tell you is that you can see the plumbing underneath the house it pretty much all looks like ABS plastic but of course the general inspector is going to do a much more thorough inspection we're here to check the main sewer line you obviously cannot check every pipe in the, in the place so we have our camera in the line and we're actually all the way to the property line where there's another clean out we'll continue our inspection from <clears throat> the sewer line has a very good grade going downhill as well so I'm going to bring the camera back here. So right over here, we'll continue from the clean out down the bottom. You can see the section of cast iron pipe over there. It comes back to ABS plastic and it comes back to cast iron piping that goes pretty much at a, at a 45 degree angle going up. This is ABS plastic. You can see how the water flies down. It's very good grade. Uh, comes back in ABS plastic. This is in good condition over here. Remember, you should never flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. This all this ABS plastic here. This is in good condition. Looks like we're in a clay pipe now. And then back to ABS plastic. Very clean though. Pretty much underneath the building here where you can see all the plumbing. You can literally stand up in the basement. The so area comes out of this clean out over here underneath the building. This is on the south side. We're going to go ahead and pause the recording. Okay, we're running the camera from the Point clean out where the pipe exits the northern building right next to the gas meters over here and I had a quick little look underneath the house you can see it's pretty much all ABS plastic so we looks like we've reached the city sewer here I'm pretty sure the two buildings are joining on but I will confirm that from the clean out down below there's the city sewer flowing by so let's bring the camera back now you can see there is a little bit of a surface crack, very minor little surface crack. In my opinion, I don't have a problem with that. That looks like more like a stress crack. A public works inspector may have a different opinion about that, but in my opinion, I don't see a problem with that. There's no roots or anything getting into it. So let's bring the camera back. Oh, look. There's a visitor. Okay, let's come back. Yeah, it comes back in a six inch clay pipe. This all looks pretty good condition. comes onto the property so a four inch clay pipe in good condition the 
slight little shift in the line, no big deal. Nothing wrong with that. No roots or anything getting through there. It's not going to prevent the water from flowing. That's where the two buildings connect with each other. And if we come back, you can see the pipe is broken over here, clearly broken. That's located underneath the step, the kind of the second row of steps underneath there. That needs to be fixed because that will leak and that will cause the soil erosion. You can see the water is probably going to leak through there. That's, so that definitely needs to be fixed. Clearly that's broken badly. So here we're going to come back. This all looks pretty good over here. ABS plastic here, good condition. Here it comes out of the clean out here. I'm going to pause the recording again. Okay, running the camera from the four inch clean out here located at the back of the middle building. It's all ABS plastic going all the way down, all in good condition. Pull it back. It's all in good condition. dirt on the end of the camera but it was all in all ABS plastic we just got some dirt on the end of the camera but this is all ABS plastic it's all in good condition with a very good grade going downhill a little bit of sludge in the line comes out of the clean out over here right at the back and uh, we'll go ahead now and pause the recording one more time okay so we're running the camera from the four inch clean out located from where we started off okay let, there's the city so come back let's see is that this different is that's the same line now looks like the crack is there's the crack yeah so there's the city. Okay, keep coming, but I'm pretty sure this is the same line. Sometimes the camera goes in at a different angle. Come back a little bit. But yeah, this all, there's a little bit of roots. There's the, I think it's the same line? No, different. The other one doesn't have roots. That's right. So there's two separate lines here. Alright, so there's a little bit of roots. At the end of the line, nothing really serious, nothing that can't be cleaned out with a jetta. So it appears that there's probably two different lines end exiting the building over here. And that will just check on the map anyway when I have a look at it to make sure. Coming back here, it all looks pretty good. Now that's my opinion. So we're looking pretty good over here. So the only thing I see really that's got a problem is uh, at the top of the steps underneath the concrete where the two pipes come together there was a very bad break in the line. Otherwise uh, considering everything looks like it's in pretty fair to good condition. Minor little cracks in the clay pipe is pretty much very common. You're going to find that wherever you go. I don't have a problem with that. A little bit of roots in the street, no big deal. Can be easily cleaned out. The sewer line here has a very good grade going downhill. But the break in the clay pipe, that definitely needs to be fixed. And 
here it comes out of the clean out here right here by the sidewalk uh, okay and uh, we'll go ahead stop the recording over here